Hi guys, so today is Thursday and that means there's a new episode of MakerCast coming out and this week I'm on it. I am super happy to be part of this. It was great talking to John and I feel even more part of the community being invited to this podcast. If you listen to the episode, you will hear me talk about a little caravan that I built for my master's degree when I studied design. Um, to document the process, I made a video of me building this caravan. This video is more than four years old and I think even though it's not a good video, it shows a huge process um, of me learning how to properly document my work and how to properly document the process. So showing you a bad video means that my videos now are better and that's I think that's great to show, you know. When I built this caravan, even though I was already living in a workshop and even though this was my master's degree, I didn't have too many tools. And I built this complete caravan with a drill and a jigsaw, some hand tools, and for a tiny bit I needed the welder that I had. So I had no table saw, no track saw, no fancy nothing. And I think hopefully that might be encouraging to you if you are just getting started. You can build big stuff even with very limited tools. So that's why I'm releasing this video. As I said, it was never meant for a greater audience. Um, please don't judge me on the editing and on the, and I know the video quality is really, really bad. I filmed it all with a little webcam because I didn't have any money to invest in the camera back then. Yeah, just keep that in mind. Um, I hope you enjoy the video. Let me know what you think as always. I'm a little bit nervous about this release really, since it's, since I know the quality is bad and all, but yeah, this is just me showing you what I did four years ago or over four years ago. I am running a little bit late. I'm meeting my friends now. Um, so I have to go there. I'm meeting them for lunch. And after that, I need to talk to you about this one friend that I'm meeting because she's awesome. Okay, I'm back from lunch and now I ask you, do you recognize this person? This is my friend Melanie and she wrote a book. It's not the first book she wrote, but it's the first book that got published and it is a huge success in Germany. She is in the top 10 bestseller list in Germany and this book got published in 21 countries and it's also coming out in America on the 5th of July. And this is what it's gonna look like. If you are looking for a good read, read this book. It is so good that Hollywood is right now working on an adaptation for a movie. Hollywood. Well, I mean, so I'm secretly planning to go to the Oscars with her. She doesn't know it, but I will force her to take me. That is crazy. I went to school with her. We've known each other for quite a long time. And not only is she unbelievably talented, she is also one of the nicest people that I know. There will be more infos in the description about this incredible book. Read it. It's, it's really good. Moving on to a jig that I used in my last video. Um, as you know, Rockler sent me all kinds of stuff. This is the taper jig that Rockler sent me. And it is very, very convenient to use. So we get this piece of oak and let's say we want to taper it. Put it in here. Tighten it up so it doesn't fly off. Here's another one. And then... So this is what you would cut off. And you can adjust this angle simply by playing around with these. 
In my case, I don't have this groove that most of the iron cast table saws have. So I would just set the fence to the exact width of this jig and then set the height of the saw blade and I can just go through. As I said, the jig is super handy and very, very easy to use. If you're looking for a jig like that, I can only recommend it. There's a link in the description as well. So Rockler, thank you for sponsoring this video. And thank you again for all the stuff you sent me. Every day I keep discovering new new jigs and, and new little gadgets that, um, that are really, really useful. So thanks. And now it's time for... Band of Skulls by default. As you know, Band of Skulls are one of my top favorite bands. And I think last week they released this album, so it's brand new. I haven't had too much time to listen to it, but so far I'm really into In Love by Default, Killer, that's the first release of this album, and um, Tropical Disease, about this record of the week thing. I am on Spotify now and I will create a playlist where all my favorite songs will go into. So there will be a playlist called Record of the Week and I think you should be able to listen to it, right? I haven't figured it out uh, yet, but I think I will do it tonight. And hopefully this will make it easier for you to listen to the songs I recommend if you want to listen to them. There's one more quick thing I want to talk about. It's my new short, short video. It's 14 seconds altogether. And it's about me building a mini stuff to make some coffee. I think that's it. So enjoy the MakerCast episode. Enjoy my Sunday caravan video. Keep in mind it was never meant to be published. So please don't, you know, I guess I will see you in two weeks then. Bye.